Sometimes you feel that you live in such a messed up time, in such a crazy world. You try to look for some solid ground to stabilize your life on and mountains are falling in front of your eyes and trees are being uprooted and flying with the wind. Houses are flying in the air, families crashing to pieces, car accidents, illnesses, plagues, weaknesses, people losing their sanity, animals are acting wild and weird. And you ask yourself, what's the end of the story? What's going on? Where are all those life experiences taking me? The real answer is, we must allow ourselves to dream. We must allow ourselves again to believe in our hopes and in our visions and to believe that they can all get together and to complete a magnificent and uplifting redemption that will unite and include all families that live their life on earth. We must believe in ourselves. We must believe that our vision, that our hope, that our dream to see a better future, to live better life, life of prosperity, full with grace and kindness, love, mutual respect, are something that we can make, something that can happen that can take place in our lives. We must move our eyes from the outside things that we see on a daily basis, from all the news, from all the rumors, to stop focus on all the terror, anger and decrees that are taking place in the world. Just to reconnect ourselves to our inner world, to our inner thoughts, to the emotions and the feelings that are waking up corresponding to all the news that we hear. If you hear that something bad happened, inside of your heart you feel that you want those things never to happen again. So it's time for you, instead of falling into the sadness and to the pressure of the outside world, to focus on your inner desire and to pray for a better future or to try to go and act in a way that will bring a much more positive reality out of the world, to function in a productive way, to go and help someone, to go and cheer up some person, to go to give a hand, to support someone, to love, to hug, to share. And with that positive attitude, we can make huge changes and to create amazing development in the world. I don't have a doubt that we can change the world completely. To remove and reject the darkness from the world in a way that will answer to all of our dreams and will provide the good to everyone that is in need and willing to take part of the wonderful redemption that is taking place right now. We need to believe in ourselves. We cannot run away from our mission, from our commitment to the truth to be truthful, to be kind. We cannot avoid our task and our mission to represent the good and to protect and fight for the weak and for those ones that are in need. We must all volunteer to that work. We must all join forces together to make a better future for all of our beloved ones. Amen.